My name is Dr. Edward Amran, and I am a triple boarded physician. I have been practicing clinical medicine for the past 25 years. At the age of 50, I made a decision to start a regimen of pharmacologics and senolytics in an attempt to alter my natural aging trajectory. I have now been on these therapies for the past 10 years. I made a series of videos uh, discussing the benefits and disadvantages of these therapies uh, for the first two years, uh, which are still available online. I stopped making videos after two years because I came to a major realization. These treatments really do work. So let me say that again. These treatments really do work. The initial choice of anti-aging therapies were metformin and niacinamide. After doing an extensive review of the research in this field, uh, those two uh, were the best options available to me at the time. And I've been adherent to this protocol for the last 10 years. But it's also introduced some new therapies since then. Now, in this preview, I want to communicate some important clinical points. The bad news first. Reversal of chronologic age is not possible with the pharmacopoeia available in 2025. This might be true in cell systems and in a limited way in mouse models, but not in humans yet. Now the good news. Stabilization of chronologic age at the start of therapy is achievable and realistic. So let me say that again. Stabilization of chronologic age at the start of therapy is achievable and realistic in 2025. In other words, I started treatment at the age of 50, and I remain physiologically 50 after 10 years of senolytic therapies. I am completely convinced that this premise is correct. The younger you start therapy, the longer your health span will be. Now, some key clinical points. Number one, these therapies require six to 12 months of continuous strict adherence to protocol before any physiologic benefit will be realized. One day, one month, three months, no realizable benefits. You need to stay with the protocol. Number two, these treatments have to be personalized for your own physiology. Every human is wonderfully unique and different. This makes clinical sense to me because you're recovering the entire cellular framework to a more healthy standard state phenotype. Number three, these interventions are not inexpensive, require frequent monitoring, changes in dose, clinical and laboratory follow-up, and are not for everyone. However, I can assure you that these treatments are much less expensive than health insurance. Now, what are the personal clinical benefits I realize after 10 years of continuous therapy? Number one, preservation of cognition and mental acuity, even when under severe stress. This is very important in my profession. Number two, maintenance of a healthy body mass index. Before I started, my body mass index was 35. After I initiated therapy, it dropped to 25, and it has remained 25 for the last 10 years of therapy. Mechanistically, I think this is similar to the GLP-1 receptor antagonists like Trulicity and Montero, although the data is very limited in this regard. Number three, prevention of loss of muscle mass and bone mass, and overall a marked improvement in skin health. Number four, complete absence of any interval development of chronic age-related diseases. No evidence of hypertension, dyslipidemia, fatty liver disease, atherosclerosis, osteoarthritis, diabetes mellitus type 2, and most importantly, no interval development of any form of cancer. Number five, these changes are not cosmetic. They represent true recovery of standard state conditions at the onset of therapy. No Botox, no fillers, no laser skin rejuvenation, but healthy physiology. 
In summary, here I am 10 years later, and I strongly contend I remain physiologically 50 years old. I wish I had started these treatments when I was 30 or 40, but at the time, I believe longevity medicine to be pseudoscientific and wishful thinking. I will make a more rigorous and complete discussion of these clinical benefits in the near future to counter the obvious skepticism. I am now taking a hiatus from clinical medicine to provide these therapies to individuals who are interested at my own longevity clinic. Please contact me below for more information if you're interested. Thank you very much.